Hey guys, this is Seal One Heart Evil, and I'm playing 3D Ultra Lionel Train Town Deluxe. <laughs> now this is fun. Now this is fun. I see the real Lionel trains. And here we go with the action. Here's the title screen. Now, um, I would have. I actually did a let's play of uh, um, 3D Ultra Radio Control Racers Deluxe Traxxas Edition about like um, um, a week ago. But um, I would have tried to do a let's play at this game first. But um, unfortunately, um, my 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 there's something Hi, wrong with my first Quiet, copy everyone. of this Thank game. <clears throat> the residents of Lionel Train Town would like to welcome you. Please sign in or choose a previous player from the list. There's actually something wrong with my first copy of this game's disc. Choose a job from one of the seven job rosters. Beginners might want to start with the tutorial job. So fortunately, I was able to get another copy of it. So that I can do it. Let's play at this game. Sorry about the flickering. And let's start with um, the tutorial jobs. Let's do the basics job. That, I think that's the only tutorial that we're going to do for this Let's Play. Welcome to Lionel's Train Town. In this first job, you'll learn how to drive a locomotive, switch tracks, and couple cars. Let's begin. First, select the steam locomotive. Simply click on it. Okay, then. Good. The locomotive appears on the toolbar at the bottom right of the screen. A train can be controlled by either clicking on the throttle or clicking on the left or right of the selected car. The throttle controls a train's speed. The red position stops the train. Clicking on a train will also stop the train. The three green positions move the train to the right. Clicking to the right of a selected car will also move the train to the right. The blue positions move the train left. Clicking left of a selected car will move the train left. A train has three speeds. Both the color and arrows indicate the current speed of a car. The car also has a small speed indicator that changes to reflect its current speed. The red indicates the car has stopped. Now, let's drive the train to the right. Either click on one of the green positions or to the right of the selected car. Let's just use the throttle and go at speed the car one. moves to the right. Speed two. Let's just slow down for Now, a let's learn how to switch the track. If the train is too close to the switch, it will not operate. However, here the train is properly positioned. Click on the switch. Okay. If position changes, you may switch it back by clicking on the switch again. Now, drive the train onto the second rail line. Now I'm going at speed three. Switch the track so that the locomotive will back down the second rail line. All right. Okay, you're ready to couple two cars. The trick is not to go too fast. Slowly back the train down and couple it to the caboose. Okay, speed three and speed one. We're slowing down and stop. I clicked the Great stop job. button too Not soon. too fast. Now, let's uncouple the caboose. Back the train down onto the third line. Stop when the caboose is in the loading zone. Okay. Let's do this. And... Stop. Okay. Position the cursor between the coal tender and the caboose. The indicator will change to an animating couple. Click to uncouple the caboose. Hmm, I actually stopped too soon. The caboose is now uncoupled. To end the job, stop the locomotive in front of the roundhouse. But don't worry, um, I'm just trying to take control of the mouse in this game. I'm actually using my PC to TV converter box for this game since I'm playing this game on my Windows 98 PC which is an HP HP Vectra VL PC there we go we're done congratulations you did it 
You now know how to control a locomotive. You've switched tracks and coupled cars. The next job will teach you how to pick up and deliver loads. I don't need to do the other tutorials. Let's just go ahead and do a couple of train parks, starting off with the Cactus Valley train park. The Cactus Valley train park wanders around stockyards for a good long piece. Scout around wherever you want and try to stay in the saddle. When you're through, just click exit. Now this place looks um, pretty interesting. Cool looking mountains. Hmm. Everything here looks really amazing. We have here the passenger diesel engine. Now let's get moving. I was just uh, um exploring around a little bit because um. I was trying to get the, um, cause during the, during the, um, the time I was recording the footage for this Let's Play, I was just, um, trying to get them, the mouse, um, um, put in place so that, uh, um, the controls, um, when I use it, um, when I use the mouse, will be easy on me, since I'm using PC to TV converter box. Let's just stop and pick up the um pick up the pinballs. Now let's put the machinery in that in the first box car. Hmm. What about the golf balls? Will they fit in the hopper? Try a gondola for this load. I actually have um, a covered um, gondola also, but I don't think it can be used. Oh well, let's just deliver the first set of loads first. I, I think I forgot about um, um, loading the oil into the tanker car. Let's deliver it to um, this building. The sets of loads will be different each time you um, um, you play one of the train park levels. Now let's deliver the pinballs and the machinery to that um, warehouse. Let's make the train go around. There we go. Now let's load the golf balls into um into the gondola, not the covered one. The original version of this game, which came out in 1999, is actually called D the Ultra Lionel Train Town. A new load is all right. All the loads have, have been delivered. I actually grew up with the deluxe version, since since it has a few more layout locations and other stuff like that. I had to make a random cut there, so sorry about that. There's nothing like just playing with trains. Check out this layout in the backyard. Explore it for as long as you want. When you're finished, click on Exit. 
Watch it, you're almost out of fuel. What? The shunting diesel engine is nearly out of fuel? How come? Let's just refuel the steam locomotive first, since it's also nearly out of fuel. Now let's, you know, go ahead and um, make room for the, for the, for the shunting diesel so that we can refuel it. I mean, refill it with fuel. Now let's go ahead and collect a, um, a couple sets of cars. Now I just picked up the the first set with um, the two box cars, the cattle car, and the refrigerator car. Now I'm gonna pick up the other set with the uh, the tanker, the gondola, uh, the hopper, I think, and the caboose. Hmm, we can't go down here because um, there's two sidings. Let's make the train head um, north. I'm trying to figure out the, the route right here. Now let's get moving. Since I think I figured out the route. I don't think we can go through the tunnel. How about if we um, head back down... Head to the, the southern part of this area. Well, I guess I didn't need to, um, um, add, add some more fuel, fuel to the, um, the, the shunting diesel engine. Now, how about we pick up the RC cars? I think, uh, um, RC cars in this game are actually used were actually used to um, um, promote the radio control racers game. This load is too large. It needs a flat car. Uh, I should have picked up uh, um, the last set one the other um, the set of um, cars with the with the flat cars. Oh well. I guess we'll have to pick up something else. How about we pick up the milk? And the cows are moving. And we should also pick up the ice cream. I see the Statue of Liberty, the castle, and everything else like that. Now let's put this in the refrigerator car. Mm. 
let's just set that um, two-way switch to go down. Uh, wait a minute. Uh, I don't think... I don't think we should do that. Wait a second. Um, let's just head down here. I think... Now let's deliver the ice cream to the depot right here, in front of the lake. Now let's, um, uh, the place where we need to deliver the milk is right here. So we need to figure out the route. The route, I meant. Again. Now let's go in reverse. Let's head down here to the flour mill. We're done with this train now. Now, just for fun, let's just drive the commuter train. Hmm, it doesn't have a fuel tank. I guess it has an endless, an endless fuel tank. And it, it's not making a sound. Except that, that when I manually, um, um, blow the horn. Let's make, make it go through that tunnel. And let's stop at the depot to end. Now let's get out of here. Yes. Now let's do the caboose washer jobs. Just to start doing the, the main activities. The main levels actually. Caboose washer jobs are very simple. Beginners welcome. Let's begin with burger time. Hands up all along the track. The workers at the furniture plant are hungry. Better pick up a load of hamburgers from the stockyard and deliver them to the workers. Pronto. Okay. Let's pick that up. Now let's stop right here to provide the workers that hamburger. There we go. Good job. Everyone's got a full tummy and it's back to making the most beautiful furniture in the valley. Thanks for your help. You're welcome. Hands up all no, along no, the track. No. I don't want to do the furniture this job again. Better. Let's do Santa's helper next. Santa needs your help. Load his sleigh onto the flat car and the reindeer into the stock car. Then hustle them over to Santa's workshop. Now let's just be careful of how I handle the mouse. And by the way, this is the first job in this game to feature the steam engine. Now let's put the reindeer in here. And let's set that switch to go down. And let's stop in front of Santa's workshop. There we go. A load of this type needs to no. be delivered here. I know. 
there we go. We're done. Well, you're a little tall for an elf, but I like the way you got that job done. Really? Santa needs your help. I'm gonna Load go. his sleigh onto I don't the black do car. This job again. Let's do fish to fry. How about landing a hand to the Train Town Anglers Club? Load the fish yeah. and some frying oil on them two tankers. Then deliver them to the depot so we can cook up a little breakfast. Okay. First, let's couple up to that, uh, um, that, um, tanker car. And let's go on the turntable. Yeah, I had to use the semaphore. I know that you can use, uh, um, the keyboard commands to take control of the trains, but, um, I'm not gonna use them just yet. I'm gonna, um, keep on using the mouse, but, uh, um, I'll have to be really careful of how I handle, um, the controls, because I want to make sure that I don't crash into anything. <clears throat> Excuse me. Now let's load up the fish. First, let's just, uh, um, just to be on the safe side, let's load it onto, um, the last tanker car. Now, let's put the heating oil into the first tanker car. Now let's go to the depot. This fish is good eating, but I'll tell you, there was this one time I horsed in this trophy bass. Bigger than a dump truck and some kind of tasty. Really? <laughs> Let's do think, think, think. Hey, Rookie, try this one. Just match the loads. Pick a car and then try to find its match. Real engineer concentration. That's what you'll get from this job. Okay. Now, um... The title of this job is clearly a reference to one of, um, one of Ween the Pooh's catchphrases, in which, um, the catchphrase, um, goes like, Think, 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 think. There. There's that, um... Where's that dragster? Oh, there it is! Hmm. There we go! We have three pairs left. Done. Ooh, that was not bad at all. We'll have to put you on the engineer candidate list. That might be a good idea. I think. Now let's do tea time. Be so kind as to toddle along a new load of balls to the mini golf course. Yeah. Seems they're getting what ready the for heck? a visit by the, the queen. What the heck? The locomotive's nearly out of fuel. Miniature golf, rarely. Watch it! You're almost out of fuel. I know. Now let's put the golf balls in here. The bascule bridge is open. Hey, there's a rubber ducky. And um, seriously, um, what does a rubber ducky have to do with a game that is based on a franchise that is mainly designed for older kids? I think a rubber ducky is just something that um, babies would play with. Now we're done. The queen actually played the course and seemed to enjoy mini golf. 
Undoubtedly due to those shiny new golf balls you delivered. Good show. Thank you very much. Let's do what a mess next. Papa told me to tell you to clean up your mess and get ready for bed. You better put your toys back in the toy box or you're gonna get in big trouble. Are you kidding me? Oh well, let's just start um loading up the um the loads. Now let's start with the the toy animals. And now let's load up the RC cars. Uh, I stopped too soon. Oh well, I'm still trying to take control of the mouse. I'm actually I was actually using a mouse on the um on um the box for my for my PC to TV converter box. I placed that semaphore at the wrong spot. No 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 no. Please switch. Now let's do the slowy this time. Switch the track and back up. There we go. Let's put the last load into the toy box. A load of this type needs to be delivered here. Seriously, I know. Oh, no, 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 no. I was, I was actually using the mouse on the on the box for my PC to TV to TV converter box, which was uh, um, a bit challenging not for fair, me to. I have to Troll, go to uh, bed, but you get to stay up till practically midnight just because you got your room clean. To take control of the controls. Oh, it's time to take a break for now, so that's about it.